Turn the casual, what's up guys, and we are back with episode, I don't even know because I haven't cut up the last one yet, um, of, uh, of the, uh, Battlefield 3 prep, and, uh, playing the same map, my Mono Oasis 24-7 server, because this is just the best map in this game, hands down, and, uh, same class, should be close to unlocking the UMP, which is probably when I'm going to start recording for tonight, but, um, still loving the game, still everything I said before sticks, this is actually the game right after. It's uh, it's not, it's not like I've been, you know, sitting a while. But I'm not gonna record every game I play. Just whenever I feel like doing a live comp, sit down and doing it. But um, yeah, I don't really know what to talk about because the last, the last recording session was kind of like my, my intro, and I was gonna do some comment feedback or something, but I don't have any comments because I haven't uploaded the last one yet. So I really don't have much to talk about. So I'm just gonna wing it and hope something interesting happens in the game that I can rant about. Or something like that, and my voice hopefully not crack anymore. But, um, yeah. So we're going to try to fudge pack him back. Crispy should be on my team this time. No, crap, he's down at the member. And Skype's still spamming, so we're fixing that right frickin' now. Quit Skype. Just going to completely close my Skype out. Yes, quit Skype. Okay. And someone's still messaging me on Skype. Are you kidding? Okay, now Skype's closed. Okay, so Skype is... I don't even know what happens when I alt-tab to fraps. It probably just seizures out. But, um, hopefully no more disturbances. Uh, I get added to these big conversations. And, uh, you know, I join sometimes, but sometimes I don't. And people don't have mics, so they just type everything. And, uh, and Skype just basically goes in completely insane. Oh, you're not combat knight for me, you whore. Hey, you better have to actually kill me. I went for the frickin' knife. But, um, yeah, it's something I wanted to talk about. Knifing in this game is uh if any of you have seen the battlefield 3 footage of uh the leaked footage the knife is actually a completely separate weapon as you can see here it's assigned i have it to my middle mouse my m3 which is pushing down on the middle mouse but um basically I, what it looks to be in battlefield 3 is a separate weapon but in this one as you can see i'm going to click it right now it takes a long time to pull it out not as long or not as long as it could be but nowhere near as short as cod and uh I like that, because COD, as you know, the knife is extremely overpowered, and, uh, and pretty ridiculous. This game kind of balanced it out pretty well. Oh, God. What? Frick, 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 frick. This game balanced it out pretty well. Um, not as good as it could have been. I still... You don't get killed a lot with it. Come on, jump the fence. Jump the fence! What are you doing? Ah! Ah, why the frick when you jump that fence? Like, I knifed half of it down, and I went to jump it, and he's like, nah. I'm just going to take the bolts in the back, bro. Don't worry about it. It's all good. Not like I want to live or anything, bro. Don't worry about it. Seems like a good day. I'm taking this freaking fence off. Or at least one of them, so I can just jump through. I, I hate that thing right there. Little things like that, I just have to destroy because they just... They, my OCD goes completely insane. Um, but yeah. That's all I can say right now is, but yeah. Because there's nothing going on. I'm going to try to to get up here and take A. Because like I said, if you can take all three points... They don't, they don't have a shot. Oh, there's a guy coming, those are teammates. People always across the road. Okay, we're getting A, we're getting A. That's good, that's very good. Actually, I might take a, type in the chat, get A really quick. And the stupid fence, now I can jump it. Now he's like, oh, I wanna jump it now. Seems like a good good time now to jump it. Not, not before when I was getting bullets ripped into my flesh. Now it seems like a good time. But, um, yeah, rant end. We lost B, really. We pushed up to A, and they slipped in our back door, and they took B. Okay, back to B. Maybe we can get it before they completely cap it. Because what happens is you take it, you take the, the enemy flag down, and then you have to put yours up. And until you get yours up, you're not getting any points for it. So if we can get them before they get theirs up, we still lose some points. When it's, oh, my God. Camping with the freaking sniper. In the bushes outside of B. Textbook. Just text. He's being a spawn point as well, probably for his squad. So they can keep coming into B. That that's a good play. I can't I can't say that's not a good play. That is an excellent play. And they're behind our spawn. Excellent. That's not a good play. That is cheap. Never do that. I will I, I can honestly say I've never camped a spawn before. I've camped points, but I've never actually camped at a deployment, which is the main spawn. <laughs> Frick. I walk up, get the first eight shots off. He like lag glitches to the right and one shots me. Are you kidding me? 
Was that just my frame rate or was because my frame should be fine. That look at this idiot man. Look at my horrible accuracy. Dear God. I was at a oh, because he's by C. But um that that uh I I don't even know. I can't get mad because it wasn't his fault. That was just the game's fault. That was or I think it was the game. Okay, this guy's getting a nade in the face. Don't bounce back out on me. Blows the windows out of doubt. We're gonna go up and take care of this cunt. He's probably sitting up here waiting for Oh crap, he's got a nade out. Oh god. Yeah, you go first. Did you get him? I hope. Or did he did he fail like a puss? Oh my god, where was he? That's freaking saga, dude. That thing is so OP, it's not even funny. And I like I said, I hate it because I can't use it well. I just suck with it. I hate that gun. And everyone gets it too. You get it at like level four. And just to show you how good it is, people still use it at level 50. That's how insanely good that gun is. And you get it so early. You get like a semi-auto attachment for it. That makes it basically an AA-12. Which, um... If you think the AA-12 is bad in M-Dubs too, just come on Battlefield and experience an AA-12 to the face. And then, then complain about the AA-12 in Modern Warfare 2. Which the AA-12 I refer to here is the, the Saga. It's basically what a semi-auto Saga is. Alt, get down, get down. Yeah, son. I didn't get it, but I'll take it. This is a game where if enemies die, you don't care if you get killed, Jack. Because when you live through an engagement, you're happy. Because basically, gun on gun, you're both done, is my rule of thumb. Usually there's no both in there, but because of the bullet, like the, the time it takes for the bullet to reach people, you basically kill each other like 90% of the time. And, like, see right there, he got the first shot off. But if we would have both hit each other at the same time... We would both... Oh, yeah, Magnum Ammo. He would have beat me anyway. He's got nine gold stars in the next M8. That, that is retarded. Ah, Syntax is coming on. I should add him up, too. Get him in here. I'm going to try to get people on here to do dual comms, live dual comms with. Might get Tank on here. Uh, might get Norco on here. Pull some people. Tell me it's not an enemy in that tank. It is. I know it is. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I don't know. Is that an enemy tank? Oh, yeah, it is. I don't even know if nades hurt it, but it's the only thing I have. And there's enemies all around me, and oh my god, that freaking saga. I would have been dead there anyway, but just because it was from that shoddy, I'm, I'm upset. I'm 2 and 7. I'm, I'm freaking, I'm, I'm 2 and 7. This is a normal game for me. That last game was just luck. This is a normal game. I don't know all the tanks down at least. This is what I normally, this is why I rage, because this is what I know, oh my god, that stupid saga, dude, that thing is so OP, oh my god, I hate that gun, can I put that on really quick, I have it, right, yeah, let's just try this thing, I've never used it a day in my life on PC, now watch, it probably will not work for me at all, see, I would have been dead there. And this guy's using a freaking shoddy too. Now I'm starting to rage a little bit because I'm 2 and 9. 2 and 9 and I'm about to leave this server. I'm about to. This thing's basically semi-auto anyway. Why do you even need an upgrade? Why do you not have a trigger finger? Frick, it's a mouse. Why would you even need a semi-auto attachment? My god. Oh god. Please get him, please get him, please get him. Of course not. I'm just gonna leave that sniper alone. Okay, this is... Ah, yeah. Are you double? Nope, assist. Take it. We have B, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna sit out here and wait for somebody. I'm not gonna go go run out and kill myself again then. I would get in the tank, but it's much better going to somebody else. I suck with the tank. Another kill, baby. I'm done. Like I'm done using fair tactics. I'm just gonna start throwing this out first, because I, I'm getting raped by sagas, and when I start getting hit by sagas is when I start playing like a douchebag. So, douchebag mode engaged. That's all I have to say. I'm gonna start freaking combat knifing people and just playing like a cunt, basically. That's what I do when I get upset. Trying not to rage for the sake of live commentary because it'll probably hurt your ears. But very close to. Wow, this thing is so overpowered. I would have been dead. I might start using this thing and just using my pistol for long range. 
god. Hit marker, kill assist, get out! No! Took me down. Good kill though, good kill. I can't get mad about that. When I actually, when I get killed legitimately, like from a good distance away, and the guy, you know, he's burst firing, he's tapping, he's doing everything right, I don't get upset because I got outplayed, and there's no argue. Oh, I forgot to put my red dot back on. But when I get killed with a freaking, really, we lost you, with a saga from like three, like three miles away, and like two shots, I rage because it upsets me. Douchebag time. Oh crap, I hit the wrong buttons to throw that nade. I meant to strafe left, and I ended up just backing up like an idiot. This guy's got him. Okay, I was going to say, this guy's got to be almost dead. Let's see if we can get a rocket stuffed back in this baby. Always keep that reloaded, by the way. That's basically my panic gun. That's my one rule. If I'm getting outplayed, I can jump back, fire at the ground, commit suicide, and take the other guy out. Suicide a lot in this game. It's actually a pretty legitimate style of plane. Oh, wow. That guy seriously just spawned right into my rocket. Oh no, it got to the guy behind. That was actually not bad. I actually may have actually just outplayed somebody without a red dot actually, actually. Just said actually like 13 times in one set. Okay. Oh, frick! Flanked. Yep, good move there though. We're too far in their spawn. We need to let him have A. And just pull out. No, that's what she said. And just, uh... And just sit there. Oh, there's our red dot. Oh, I love the red dot. I cannot use the iron sights. The gun jumps too much. It's, it's actually good to recoil. It's not, I don't know, it's not really recoil, but the iron sights jump, but the gun doesn't, and it's its just hard to keep your target while burst firing. So, the the four times zoom is good on assault rifles, on the SMGs, it, well, it's basically, it'd be like using an ACOG, for those of you, I'm going to try to use COD terms, that's all I know, but um, it's basically like using an ACOG on like an Uzi, it's just, gun on gun, you're done, son. I rhyme. Oh god. <laughs> that was such a horrible kill. Oh, I'm tempted to type my B in the chat. That was bad. I play games. I, I respect people in games. I do. If I'm I don't base rape, I don't sit behind people's spawns, and if I do, I type, you know, sorry about this in the chat. I, I'm I'm very respectful on PC. Console, I don't give a crap, because everyone's like a ten year old I F your mom squeaker type kid. I don't care, but on PC everyone's so respectful. I wanna I want to return it. You know, like, people don't fight on PC. You see in the chat, I wish they were doing it now, but people all the time in the chat, you know, they'll they'll have, like, they won't argue, but they'll have discussions on certain things, and that's what I love about PC. It's such a more mature community. It's not, you know, it's, I don't know, console, all I can say, I can basically base it as an age group. PS3 with the Blu-ray player and all the weird arcade games is basically, oh, God. Oh, yep, I got outplayed. I was dead there anyway. But, um... PS3 is basically like your your 3 to 8 year old stage. Xbox is your 8 to 13 year old stage. Or 8 to 15 I'll say. 8 to 14. Somewhere in there. And then PC is up. Because PC people are just they're mature. They they know what they're doing. I'm not saying that PS3 can't be. You know. Or console in general can't be. But I'm saying community age wise. Or community acting age wise I should say. And the way people act. That's just how I feel. And I'll probably do a separate commentary on it. But that's just a quick overview of how I feel and why I enjoy PC so much, to be honest. Um, as bad as I am at it... Okay, this guy's gonna get raped. Stupid saga. Taste that nade, son. Taste that nade. No way did I only get a hit mark. 